Hello and welcome to The Alexander Show. Today on the show is recording artist Dominic Illy, who's going to be on the show to discuss his debut EP, Colors, and his new song, Sunflower, which releases Monday. So without further ado, Alexis, run The Alexander Show. Running The Alexander Show. Dominic, hi and welcome hi. to The Alexander Show. Hi, thank you for having me. So, you recently released your debut EP, Colours. Tell yes. me a bit about it and the songs you have on it. Um, okay, so there's three songs. I released it a little um, later last year. Um, it's called Colours. There's Colours, the song on there. Um, Sad and Love Again. So, this whole EP, um, each song is like really, really different from each other. So, Colours is... Um, kind of about having like finding happiness through quarantine during like 2020 when like COVID was just like a huge huge thing and for kind of finding happiness in the world we were living in. Um, sad was basically the literal opposite of that. Um, it was like being in quarantine and like all the sad things about it and kind of like just life being depressing right. um, and then love again was a love story um, from a few years back that I wrote about and that's one of my favorite songs actually I like that song a lot so when you're writing a new song yes. like any of the songs in in your EP yes and you're thinking about writing and you might pull out I know you play the guitar and the piano yeah, yeah, yeah. Do, which instrument do you go to when you're writing a new record so I like to lean towards the piano a lot like I don't know what's with it like I really really love the piano like the piano it just ren like resonates to me and like whenever like I'm like oh I like that let's put it on the piano or like oh yeah, yeah yeah and then if I feel like oh yeah this should have a guitar on it I'll go to the guitar but mainly usually first it's the piano nice so um I really love the piano intro yeah. in one step at a time which yes. is one of your songs yeah, that you released. Yeah. So, did you, did you play that? Did you, were you the one who created those yeah, chords? Yeah. So, in the how that happened was, we, I was in the studio with my friend Andre. He's older than me, but we were in the studio, right? And um, we were just like, oh yeah, what are we gonna do for this song? We know it's gonna be like a sadder song, you know. I was like, oh, I know. Let's just play on the piano. So we were playing on the piano, and I just came up with this cool, like, little piano intro, and like. That's so cool. Put it on the track. And we recorded it, and that's the one that we used. Love that. Yeah. So your new song, Sunflower, releases yes. in two days Yes. on Valentine's Day. Yes. Uh, is there any significance on why it releases on Valentine's Day? It's a love song. So we decided the best time to release it was be on Valentine's Day because it's going to be a love song. Um, the whole entire song is about um, kind of having this perfect person in your head and like al almost like having a relationship with them, but they're not real in a way. So right. the, um, the whole thing in the la end of the chorus, um, it says something about like um, dreaming about you with no one to hold, so then I wake up alone, kind of thinking about them, but they're not actually there in your life. You know what I mean? Yeah. So when you're creating a new song, yes. some people like to come up with a lyric first and, yes. and stem off of that idea. Some people like to use a piano chord or something mm -hmm. like that. What is your go-to thing to go with and roll off of to make yeah. a record? Yeah, so I do a ton of different things. I'll either go in the studio and work on the beat first or like I'll just find the lyrics and I'll be like, oh, yo, this is really, really cool. Let's find something that I can put this off of. Um, I tend to lean towards making a beat or putting something on piano force before I make the lyrics, but every single time it's completely different. Right. That sounds really cool. Will you be releasing the music video at the same time as the song? Or will you be waiting a week or two before and just teaser it mm -hmm. for ready for people to look forward to? Yeah, so we're actually releasing the music video at the same time as the song. It's going to be on all streaming platforms, YouTube. Spotify, everything, Apple, it, if you have it, it's there. Well, I'm super excited to watch the music video and listen to the song on Monday. This next part of the show is called Quick Fire Facts. Dominic, I'm going to ask you a series of quick fire questions okay. that you're going to answer as fast as possible. All right, perfect. Okay, ready? Yes. Favorite music genre? R&B. Favorite Italian food? Pasta. Favorite color to wear? Black. 
most dreaded school subject? Social studies. <laughs> <laughs> Tyler the Creator or Travis Scott? Tyler the Creator by far. Favorite movie of all time? A Dog's Purpose by far. I love that. I love yes, that. Yes, I love that movie so much. Salty or sweet? Salty. What critter makes you go? <laughs> oh God! Um, a spider. A spider, definitely. Spider. Sonic the Hedgehog or Pac Man? <sighs> Pac Man. Pac Man. Pac Man. Classic. Mm -hmm. Yes. We'll be right back with more of the Alexander Show, so stay tuned. Stay tuned for more of the Alexander Show. Hello and welcome back to The Alexander Show. I'm here with my guest Dominic Illy. And today we are going to be doing a section of the show we like to call Game On. Today we are playing the great game What's in the Box. And Dominic, you're going to be putting on a blindfold and guessing what is in this box. Fun. <laughs> so Fun. if you want to <laughs> put that blindfold on. Yes. And uh, get, we'll get started. Oh god, okay. Okay, so Dominic, we have yes. three items to share with you that are in the box. Okay. And each of them you are going to have to guess. Okay. With the clues that I give you. Okay, okay. Okay. Can Ready? Like, yes. Put your hands in the box. Okay. Oh, it's a bowl. Okay. Try not to squeeze too hard. I... <laughs> is it alive? <laughs> oh god, what is this? Oh. It feels... They're better in numbers. Is it alive? Is it the, wait, are these worms? Wait, 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 no, no. Don't, don't squeeze it too hard. Oh God, I feel like it's alive. <laughs> Put your wait. hands, dig in there, oh. and scoop them up and guess what it is. <laughs> um, wait, oh wait, is it ramen? That's my final guess, is it ramen? Moving on to the next thing. <laughs> I'm not gonna say yes or no. Okay. Moving on to the next okay. thing. Okay. Put your hands in the box and guess what's in the bowl. Oh, oh I can smell it. Oh God. Okay, it's a bowl again. Oh. Oh. Ew. You can squeeze a little harder on these, just not too much, okay. not too much. Okay. What is this? Just feel them around, don't squeeze too much. Keep going. Does it smell? Ew, it does smell a little <laughs> bit. Um, oh. Um, Wait, no, no, not that one, not that one. No? Place okay. that one down. Pick up a different one. Can I one. pick up this one? Yeah. Okay. Um, uh, it's like a bigger worm. <laughs> um, oh, there's prickly. Oh, um. Oh, wait, let me smell it again. <laughs> Ew! Okay, wait. Okay, wait. do you have a guess yet? Yeah, um. Anchovies? Anchovies. Okay, that's your guess? Yes, that's my guess. Moving on okay. to the next thing. It was smelled so bad. Okay, so this last one. Okay. You can get your hands really dug in there. It's not living. Okay, that's good to know. <laughs> oh, papers. Oh. And you can wiggle your hands in and oh. press, yes, exactly, <laughs> press down, feel, feel it out, I feel maybe like... scoop it around a little. Okay. Yeah. Is this jello? Wait. <laughs> okay. Is that your guess? I think it's jello. I you think, think it's jello? Yeah, I think it's jello. Okay. This is fun. <laughs> <laughs> My hands are so dirty now. So, in summary, Okay. I've pulled all three bowls out, all right. and you're going to put your hand in each one and tell me exactly what you guess it is. Okay. Um, so there's one directly in front of you right now. Oh, uh, okay. Are these the anchovies, or are these the are these worms? Wait, I think these are the anchovies, right? They're not yeah. anchovies. What were they? Oh wait, they're prickly. We'll reveal them after. Okay. <laughs> okay. The next thing is now directly in front of you. Okay. This was the ramen. I, these are either really big worms or ramen. I feel like this is ramen though. Okay. This is ramen. Okay. And the last one. Okay. 
This is the Jello. I'm not gonna do that again. <laughs> okay. That's the Jello. <laughs> okay. Okay. So you can go at. Well, take the blindfold off. Uh, okay. Oh, they were pickles. Okay. <laughs> yeah, I was right. Yeah. Okay. Okay. So you guessed the ramen. This is yes. this is this is not worms. It's ramen. Yes. Okay. Good. <laughs> uh, this is Jello. Jello. And off screen, you did guess that it was red Jello. So that's that's pretty good. And uh, those are gherkins, pickles. Yeah, pickles. They're not yeah. anchovies. Not anchovies. Yeah. <laughs> Thank God. And not but, alive. Yes. <laughs> okay. Fine. Sadly, that's all we have time for today. Dominic, thank you so much for coming on to the show. Of course. All of my guests on the show leave with a gift, so I have gotten you a premium Brit World scarf. Yes, this is beautiful. <laughs> <laughs> Dominic, where can people find and connect with you? Um, you can find me at Instagram at Dominic Ailey, um, at Dominic Ailey, um, on YouTube and all streaming platforms at Dominic Ailey, and at my website, DominicIlly.com. And thank you so much for watching. You can check out my YouTube channel at Alexander James Rodriguez for more of The Alexander Show and follow me on all social media platforms at I am AJ Rodriguez. Until next time. Alexis, close out The Alexander Show. Closing The Alexander Show.